Another option in blowpipes is the Gibson style blowpipe, also a telescoping blowpipe just as the others. This can be replaced or swapped out with a oval mouthpiece and it does come in junior and standard sizes. This one has the actual external blowpipe uh, backflow valve. Gibson also offers a option of an internal valve. Uh, to access this valve is a little different than the other models where the, the uh, piece comes apart just above the projection mount with the valve on the interior of the upper part of the stem. Again, when we're using these style valves, when we got them apart, we want to make sure that the, in, the internal parts are clean of any type of debris so that we get a good solid seal when we apply pressure so there is no air coming through the back, back side of the, the blowpipe. Many of the blowpipes that we offer have the option of an imitation ivory projecting mount to match your existing bagpipe. On many of these, the materials can be quite different and in appearance. So sometimes it's a bit tricky to match your bagpipe e exactly. Many of them do come with a standard black imitation mount that uh, it obviously cleans up any idea of trying to match what's on the, the, the rest of the bagpipe. McCallum also offers a adjustable blowpipe, one that does come with every set of pipes. That we, uh, that we sell, but also they have the option of a universal blowpipe which has the pivot ball joint on it. A locking nut allows you to position the angle of the blowpipe as you wish, and this also has a telescopic stem, and it allows you to remove your mouthpiece from your standard McCallum blowpipe and attach it to a universal for maximum comfort. As so, and then you can use this at any angle you like. There is no standard fitting on mouthpiece threading, but they are very close and on many of the manufacturers there is enough clearance that with just a little bit of Black wax temp applied to the threads would snug up many mouthpiece options so that you could use your original uh, mouthpiece from your set of pipes on just about any, uh, any blowpipe option that, we, that you may be looking at. With Airstream, Airstream sells their famous mouthpiece with the oval and mouth guard. It does fit over many of the types of bagpipes now on the market. Sometimes just a little bit of black wax temp to snug it up and also creating a bit of a gasket so we don't have moisture or air leakage uh, on it. But they do work so you could take and add this to your existing blowpipe. For many players, a problem with their blowpipe can tend to be the fact that the blowpipe is pulling away from the mouth when they do not have it clamped down in the teeth. One of the ways of correcting that is to go to something, one of the ball joint type uh, blowpipes. They adjust and you can change the angle so that the blowpipe is always towards the to the mouth creating uh, relieving the issue of the blowpipe kicking back out of your mouth every time you open to take a breath. This does take that away. With the universal the McCallum universal ball joint you you have that option it's an exterior valve and you can take your existing blow, uh, mouthpiece, many of them, which would fit straight on there, adding a little bit of black wax temp to create a good snug fit. Many mouthpieces would fit this. Another unique aspect to the universal ball joint is the fact that you can transfer your existing mouthpiece to this, to this uh, uh, mouth uh, blowpipe. Many of our uh, mouthpieces have nice silver work and ivory bulbs and such. So this leaves you the option of coming back and actually putting on your existing mouthpiece. Sometimes if the joint is too loose, all it really takes is a piece of black wax temp. 
It's easily applied to the threads. Then you can come back and thread this on and create a very snug fit and then continue to use your ornamented mouthpiece. To properly measure the length of the blowpipe, we take a measurement from the outside position of the projecting mount to the end of the, blow, uh, the mouthpiece. In this particular case, we would be looking at 11 and a half inches. So your point of measuring is where the hemp line and the projecting mount actually start. Roughly speaking, when you are dealing with someone who is under 5'6", five, 5'7", five, you may need to look at going to a junior, or as some, uh, some companies call, child size uh, blowpipe, so that you can take the size down for that particular person. They still, you're dealing with a telescopic, but you're, you're shortening the stem, creating a, a better fit for someone of that stature. Having your blowpipe properly fit you is a very important aspect to playing the bagpipe correctly. So do not overlook the idea that your blowpipe is either too long or too short. There are many options, telescopic, oval, internal valves. These are all things that should be taken into consideration when you are purchasing a blowpipe or mouthpiece. If you have any further questions over blowpipes, mouthpieces, and valves, feel free to call us here and we would love to help you and answer any questions you have.